What's correct, then, everybody? I'm Grimmaster. Welcome to Hammer Helm. Uh, this was a little, like, colony sort of survival building game that intrigued me, and I got a key to it, and I figured I would give it a shot. Uh, I've seen it a few times on Steam and everything. Let's go here. Let's go palest that could possibly be. There we go. Tuna color. Purple. Hair color. I don't know. This is types of hair. It's not really much types. Let's go with the normal hair color. Not hair color. There we go. I want that one. Boom. Yeah, I'm down. That's hair color. That's not beard color. Actually, I am down with that one. There we go. Let's go there. And grill confirm. A new home. Banished from your homeland for the rebellious act of suggesting dwarves could live above ground. You've spent months wandering and seeking new fertile lands to start your new life in the open air. You have finally found such a spot, far enough away from your stronghold as to not anger your old clan, but close enough that your success will attract others who, like you, are tired of living underground. As you build the town, you will happily come to seek out and live in new homes. Okay, people are going to come here. They're not only... Oh, not only ones watching, however, as your town grows in wealth, so will the threat of goblins and orcs. They have already begun building small encampments to prepare to attack the first dwarves who aren't protected by the underground fortress. Okay. So we're going to get attacked by people like... Quickly is what you're telling me? Alright, so we're supposed to have... Open up my inventory. An axe. A shield. And I got potions? Is there like... Quick bar? Quick bar! Alright. I mean, I don't know if this is going to be a thing, but can I put that up there? No. It just stays there. Alright, and then we can just go up, attack things. I think. 100%. Can I... Yeah, okay. We just go up to stuff and attack it. We break it open and we get wood, trees, all that fun stuff. Okay, it's laying on the ground. I like how it falls over in a straight line. Alright, so, and then we have... A mini-map up at the top? But... Isn't there, like, some sort of... Okay, press P to open up the build. You must be inside the town area. Okay, I assume this is the town area because this thing just popped up on the bottom of the screen. Alright. And then, so, do, 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 build the basics. So we need a storehouse, I assume. It allows you to storage, resource, and items and have up to three storehouses. All right, well, let's craft that up. I feel like that's going to be a necessity right away. Uh, rotate. And slap you up right here. I mean, this looks like a good place, right? There's like a mine right here. What else do we have? It moves very slowly. I mean, it's a pretty big town space. Uh, I feel like let's... I don't want to be right in the middle. Cause I assume there's probably going to be walls or something if we're going to be attacked. Let's put a storehouse up. Do we still have enough? We do still have enough. All right, I'm going to put a wooden house up too. Rotate. Put you right there. Oh. Uh. Backyard. Okay, we get do we get people right away. Choose two people. Let's say we get three people. Hey, this reminds me of uh. Ani. Uh, oxygen not included. Olaf, oaf and healthy. Mole, mole and animal lover. Loves being in the mines or underground. And hunting or hurting animals in any way. What? And whores. Because he's an animal lover. Okay, I thought he wanted to go out hurting them in any way. Like, jeez. <laughs> Strong and claustrophobic. Okay, I'll take you. Uh, Olaf loves doing manual labor of any kind. Is less likely to catch illnesses. Well, that sounds good. Alright. So, they're just, what, building stuff up now? I got skill experience. Oh, they are. They're just building it up. So, wait, there's nothing in here yet, then? Nope. Alright, you guys are building. Whoa, you just got bigger. Whoa, you just got a fence. You know what it looks like right now? Just a big old empty space. Okay. I'm supposed to talk to him? Press T to speak. Did you finish it? Yeah. Structure is completed. Oh, it looks different inside now. Hey, we got all our stuff. Your inventory? Oh, you're telling me I could put it into the town. I see. Okay. What the heck was that? Did he just chop down a tree? What's up, dude? I'm supposed to talk with you. Hello, girl. Is there something I can help you with? Uh... Quest? Ask about the activity outside of town. I am gatherer. Okay, get stone. Quest. Hello, Grill. 
This is a perfect spot to build their town, but I saw some goblins to the east. I think they think they followed us here, and they don't look friendly. Okay, find three monster camps near town and destroy them. Okay. Over here? It's a little mini-map marker. So my people are just going to be chopping down trees and all that stuff? Oh, I see something. What is all this? Middle click for power attack, or R. Block is right trigger. Dodge left and right. Dodge backwards. Dash attack. Okay. Let's do this. Oh! Oh, whoa. He just headbutted him. That was great. Alright, let's go, man. Wait. Are you doing, like, lightning damage to me? Oh, get out of here. Why, why is, what's, why is my hand all crazy? I'm gonna do the dash attack. Boom! Knock you on your butt. Oh, that's great. It actually knocks him down. What is happening with your glowy hands? Oh, I can do this. Press G to open chest. Leather? Okay, thank you. I guess I got leather for that? That's cool. Still more camps. I don't have a lot of life, though. Is this... What, can I... So, is this, does this work the same way? Can I attack bushes? No. Okay, we don't need to just attack bushes. That's good. <laughs> right. Oh, monster brutes. Brutes are more powerful monsters are going to perform special attacks. Okay, so you're the more dangerous one is what you're telling me? Oh, you didn't get knocked down. Oh, oh, there's only, oh, there's a timer on how long you can use this. Ah! No, I was trying to do this button. There we go. Uh, ah, run! Nope, I guess I'm just moving. That works too. Oh! I should probably not be near him when he does that. That was a mistake. I didn't realize quite how bad he was going to hurt me. Alright. There's a loot all button I noticed as soon as I finished that. Uh, last one's over here. I'm gonna drink a potion. Because, yeah. Look like I got hurt. Spellcasters have the ability to cast various spells and defense spells. So you're telling me to take out the spellcaster. Kaboom! I missed you. Well, I mean, apparently you missed me too, so that works. Can I, can I charge you? Boom! Alright. Got 108 gold. I'm down. Got a whole bunch of leather. Something in the storehouse is taking... Something in the storehouse is taking things without permission to investigate it. Gain a skill point. Press I. I have a skill point? Oh! Reduces the damage from physical attacks. Uh, reduces... When reduced to zero hit points, a chance of death is avoided when blocking an attack. This is the amount of stamina when sprinting. Increases damage from a dash attack. Chance of it to find more gold from treasure. I didn't mean to click on that. Chance to find more loot from treasure chest. Reduce the damage from spells. Recharge your attack power after killing a monster using an, a power attack. Honestly, I want to be able to run more. Without having my stamina go down. That always drives me nuts in games. When you run out of stamina just simply from running. Like, no! I want to run forever! Oh, I have to go back to the storehouse to figure out who's stealing all my stuff. Is there a dude in my, in my storehouse stealing it? Because I'll, I'll, I'll fight him. Oh, what's happening here? What's this about? Why is there colored thingies coming down? What? These kobolds or something? That's what they look like. Hey, dude. And, oh god, what happened here? Hey, 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 hey. No. My health is not good. I didn't get anything. There's nothing there. Sad days. Okay, heavy metal. Hold P, or press P to build another house in a metal worker shop. Okay, I need to build another house, but a metal worker shop. Metal worker shop. Oh, I need another house because of that. Alright, well, I'm just gonna slap you up right next to the other one. I mean, we could just do start doing a street here. Oh, and I get two people every time I put a house down. Loves to craft and sometimes makes masterwork items. 
and walks and runs faster than most dwarves. Well, yeah, you sound good then. Less likely to catch illness and loves being in the mines or underground. Uh, it's strong and can carry more resources. Is happier when the town is beautiful. Well, it's going to be you. Because, uh, I mean, there's this mine here, and ideally I'd like to send people in there. Metal worker shop. I have two houses now. Will you let me do it? Uh, one more. What? What's, what's happening here? There we go. It's like it wasn't moving. Okay. Oh, am I inside this house? I am inside this house. No, that's the blacksmith shop. Yay! What do the houses look like when they're done? I mean, is it actually done? Because it looks like it's missing pieces. Maybe we, maybe those are things we can upgrade and add to the houses later on. All right. Well, you need to finish building this. We need a blacksmith. This is metal worker. I mean, why don't you just call a blacksmith? That's what it is, right? All right. Come back out here because you're gonna get finished. Yeah, there we go. Now let's go inside. <laughs> this is. I'm down. Uh, press Shift V to open the town menu and assign a metal worker. There was somebody who was meticulous, right? Loves to craft items. Yeah, there we go. Quarrying stone? No. Metal worker? Left quick door porch. Oh, I think I actually click on the portrait. Okay. So now you're a metal worker. Good, good. Speak with the metal worker about crafting copper items. Metal worker, get in here. I need you to get to your job. Is this you? Oh. Is that good? Are you not happy about something? Is there something I can help you with? Copper item. Thanks for building the shop. I can craft better items for you if you find some copper ore. The mine entrance is blocked, but I know where you can find some ore nearby. Okay. Did you tell me? Yes, you did. It's over here. Mine the three copper ore deposits near town. Why is there only three copper ore? It's kind of messed up. Hey, can I hop up here? Okay, I see one. This is a weird thing to be mining with, though. You know, walking around mining with this. What, can I Can I just pick you up? Nope. Alright, whatever. The mushrooms just sit here. They look like they should be picked up, but they can't be. Alright, I need to break you. Tin copper ore. I like that actually has a health. It tells you how long until you break it compared to like this. You just don't even know. <laughs> I guess it's about three hits. Uh, mine. Right here. Copper. There's one more after this. Where are you? Up here? Yeah. I'm gonna drink a potion because apparently your health doesn't just fill up automatically. I was like, maybe my health will fill up over time, and I've been watching it as it moved. The health does not fill up over time. Ooh, minor, minor achievement. I think I got a couple other ones, I just haven't been paying attention. Uh, sprint? I was like, that can't be your sprint, right? You gotta be able to run faster than that. Alright, now I just need to go craft a new item at the metal, work shop, metal worker shop. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Is there gonna be like a open mine option? I mean, there's a lot of things it says we have on here. Shift V to open the town UI. Shift V. Well, what is this? This is what I want to know. Raw veggies, cooked food, raw meat, handles, tools, weapons, beer, leather, clothing, coal, cotton, wheat, blood blossoms, glowberries, spider thorn. My god, there's so many of these things I don't even... Is it jade? Gold, diamond, bloodstone, iron, copper... Okay, hey dude, uh, I need you to make stuff for me. You. Craft. What? I mean, I assume I need you to make copper ore before anything, right? Oh, I just click on it and just make a bunch of it up. Okay. Uh, copper hammer? Smash attack, more for dash attack. And copper axe? Is that what I want to make? Did you tell me what I'm supposed to make? And yeah, just to simply craft an item. Okay, well, let's make the copper axe. Why not? There we go. Is that better than what I have? A simple axe? Damage 25, 40. Oh, and it's a masterwork. What? 
That's good, right? That's gotta be good. Okay, uh, copper sword, copper home. Oh, what? There's all kinds of stuff we can make. Whatever. I did what I was supposed to do. Speak with Hugo the worker and ask to clear the entrance. You! Talk to you! Why is everybody just standing directly in front of their houses like this? It's kind of creepy. Alright, well, hey. Uh, I can clear the mines for you. Just give me a moment. Okay. Are you... Are you gonna go do it? Clear mines. Goodbye. Are you gonna go clear it? What are you doing? <laughs> just like, she's just standing there like, Hey, what's up? <laughs> Come on, come on, let's do it. I got a copper axe, I wanna go in there. I mean, I could've technically just done that if that's what you're doing. Enter and clear the mines near town so you can gather stuff. Abandoned a long time ago, these mines are now home to vile creatures. Before the townspeople could begin mining here, you must make it safe. Okay, I just gotta slaughter people is what you're telling me. Fall on your face. Oh wow. Spin, these guys are weak. These guys are super weak. Give me some more copper. All right. I assume just me getting stuff is not gonna be like, oh, well now they can't find anything, because that would be horrible. How far do I need to clear in? I mean, I guess I'll just keep going. Boom! Is that a caster? Oh, he's using poison or something. Oh, I was just using my special and the special went away. I mean, can I do this? Oh, it disappeared again. You don't have long to use that special skill. All right, copper, copper ore. Keep trucking down here. I don't know how long, how big these mines are. Oh, monsters left. It says up at the top right. I swear to God, anything on the right hand side of the screen, I just don't see. I am so blind on that side, like legitimately blind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Boo! That was a waste. Mine's cleared. I get a no, no. I want, I want to loot the treasure chest. Get leather, and I get a bunch of red mushrooms. Okay. And then there's more copper because I'm gonna get all the copper in here. A boot. Is that all? Press escape to loot. That's all? Literally, I just press the escape button. and I'm outside the mines. What is happening? That is not how people do. Leave the mines and press shift V to open the town menu inside a miner. Um, mostly because you're being weird. Oh wait, no, you're claustrophobic. Miners. Mole. There we go. So you should be ha happy because you like being underground. I don't know what's happening over there though. It looks almost slightly disturbing. So wait. Did I get another level up? I did get another level up. Blocking an attack, reduced... No, where's the one that increases my damage? Right here, chance to loot, no, reduced damage. Recharge, reduce the damage from physical attacks. What? Increase the damage from... From a dash attack. I guess this one. It's uh, take less damage. It's probably better in, all, in the long run. So there are no more missions? Do we need to complete our missions? What do you have? About. Enter the dungeon and destroy it. What? What? Dungeon. Well, first, before we go anywhere, I mean, this town is a lot of space, right? What else do we have we can build? Um, Stone Champion's Home. Place where you lit for you to live. Place a bed inside to regain hit points. So this is for me? Wooden house, stone house. Oh, I can't do the stone house. I can do farms, though. I feel like this is something that's actually probably necessary. No, it's not. I can't do it because I don't have the metal. What does it require? Iron? Or just metal of any kind? I mean, if it takes metal of any kind, I could just go put all the stuff I have in the town, right? Shift V. Nope. That's not how. I think I actually have to go into the storehouse to put it in there. You, right here. Wait, 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 wait. No, yeah, that's no, just townsfolk. Resources. Townsfolk. Okay, no, this is how I do it. Alright, um. 
It's because like, I don't know how to... There we go. That's the most I can put into the town inventory. That's all you can have? Oh, we're maxed out on wood? Okay, so if I put this in here, is he just going to turn this into iron, like, into ingots? What is this? I want to know what this is. And in general, I don't even know. Okay, what is in my inventory? Do I have to get away from this to actually open my inventory? Quality stone. That's what we need. We need stone. Okay. Uh, Put all this stuff back in here. There we go. You, outside. Go get stone. Did you go get stone? I hope so. So we need call we need quality stone. Alright, well I guess we're gonna go look at this dungeon. We're gonna go check out this dungeon. I like this game. This game's cool. I like I enjoy just to be able to boop, here's a thing, and just plop down stuff. All it takes a ton of stone though, so yeah, it really I mean that's what we need more than anything else. So you guys need to get stone. Get a ton of stone, I'm gonna roll backwards. Find this dungeon. At the same time, I mean, I guess I could be getting stone, too. How many hits does it take to break a stone? Eh, we get two stone for each one. That's not too bad. But, I want to go to this dungeon. Dungeon, 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 I don't know where it is. It looks like there's... No, that's a tree off in the distance. I don't know how big this map is. Is there a map button? Nope, there's no map button. At least as far as I can tell. That is not the right button. That was Steam Overlay. What? It's just a box. It's just a box hanging out here. Alright, let's go inside. Dungeon of Curses seems ancient. You can hear the creatures moving around. Be on your guard. Oh, sweet. Okay, I'm going to break everything. I was just going to say, can I break things? This directly tells you, here's some gold. So yeah, I'm going to do that. Hey, come at me. Come at me, skeleton dude. Let's do it. Right, that's not the right button. I'm supposed to charge attack him. Oh, I didn't knock him on his butt. Ooh. Okay. As long as I stay in the... Yeah, I'm not going to go straight into the fire. Alright, now I'm good. Ah, charge. Why do you not do the attack when you're supposed to? It's brutal. Okay. Oh, oh, okay. I was like, I thought he was dead after the charge attack. I'm like, yeah, we got this. Not so much. I'm gonna drink another potion. I have to figure out how to make potions. Alright, skeleton dude, let's go. Can you walk into the things? Oh, no. Apparently not. Ah, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. He's attacking forward, that's not good. Oh, I didn't even know there was... I was like, wait... There's only one here? No, there was two. Ah! Ah! Why won't you roll like you're supposed to? Oh, because I'm pushing the wrong buttons. That's why it's not rolling. Back off. The whole time I've been pushing the wrong buttons fighting. I couldn't I couldn't figure out what was going on. Alright, that's all. Just like that. I just gotta push escape to leave the dungeon again. It's really weird. I like the fact that I don't have to like work my way back out of the dungeon again, though. Uh, find the monster camp near town and destroy it. Alright. Well, but I guess everybody else is just doing their thing, right? <laughs> just gonna go and just continuously slay everything that I see. Is one of you a caster? Red name. Why does this button never work? Do I not have to... Can I not be moving when I'm charging? Boom. You're dead. I got more leather. Got an achievement, Monster Hunter. What's happening right now? It's like stuck in place. I didn't like it. Alright, I'm gonna just try to get some stone. Get some stone and go back and we can actually build some more buildings? Because I just get a little bit here and I, they're getting stone out there while we're gone. Speak with a I'll move I can't say their names. And ask about the past. What what and the what but what if he doesn't want to talk about his past? Maybe he has dark secrets that he doesn't want to speak. 
Wait, I guess we should probably know that if he's living in our town. <laughs> Did you murder somebody? Uh, I like, okay, I can actually see, like, there's a little bit of a, a difference between the grass texture when you enter your town. Yeah, because we're in our town now, I got 15 stone. Does it count the, fi like, the 15 stone doesn't count what's on me. So I'm pretty sure I alone have eight. Yeah. Alright, um, where are you? Over here. Oh, is it getting daytime? It was just nighttime, I think. I honestly don't know. As far as building stuff, yeah, it takes so much stone. Dude, you just need to go get stone. What are you doing? Just hang oh, you need to talk to me. Uh, quest. When I was much younger, I used to love venturing outside to pick apples from a tree near our fortress. It would be wonderful if we could find a way to quickly grow an apple tree with our apple I found. Okay, go get stone. Goodbye. You. You're mining. Goodbye. Wait. If you're mining, why are you standing here? Bring a, bring Alf's apple to the magic pool near the ruins? There's a magic pool over here? I never saw any such thing as that. What are you talking about? Okay. What is it? Is it over by these pink... Whoa! Is it over by these pink trees? There's a ruins right here. I don't know how I didn't see that. Why is there pink trees? Just to show that this area is magical? Can I chop down said pink trees just because I can destroy things that are beautiful? No, you can't. <laughs> Alright. How did I not see this? This is like really big area. This isn't even what I'm looking for? No, this is not what I was looking for apparently. Looking for is over this way. Oh, I see. It's probably this. Yep, right there. Okay, so why am I bringing this apple to the magical pool? Magical pool imbues the apple with powerful and natural magic. Bring the magic apple to Al... Alf... Almuf. Almuf, his name is Almuf. I don't care how you're supposed to say it. It's so weird. <laughs> it's not weird. It's just different. And I don't know how to say it. Uh, up here is back to town? I'm out of stamina. Is that what the second potion is? Why would I drink a potion for stamina when I could just stop and stop moving? I mean, I could just, I'd like, literally, I'm sitting here gathering this stuff and my stamina's, oh, I would say it was going up, but maybe not while I'm actually attacking. Okay, well, I can go at least put the stones away and give the dude the apple and... I don't know, he's probably gonna tell me to build a farm, is my guess. I feel like the farm is something that we probably should be having up and, you know, life-sustaining foodstuffs and everything. Kind of vital to keeping a town alive. Down here? I could just run right off. So you're gathering stone then, buddy? Yeah. Wait, I'm supposed to talk to you anyways. Hey. Uh, quest. Oh, thank you, the tree grew so quickly and looks great in front of my house. Goodbye. Wait, what? Oh, you do. He has an apple tree right there. What's up? I was like, there's, there's a tree out here now? All right, what have you been getting? Looks like we have our food over here. So food supplies are probably good, right? I don't know what all that is. Uh, Add all that. We got 38 stone total in here. It's not bad. I don't think that's enough, unfortunately, to build anything. Oh, wait, I'm looking at stuff, like, way down here. Sewers? Oh, there's all kinds of stuff. Holy crap, look how far down it goes. There is, there is, uh, walls, though. Yeah, stone wall, stone entrance, infirmary, mage tower. No wonder these things cost a crap ton of stone. That's, like, way down there. I'm not anywhere near that. Carpentry shop? Like, I'm still way up here. A cookhouse. Cookhouse seems like a good thing. Cooks use raw meat. Okay. You can place up to four cookhouses. Requires a metal worker shop. It's a hunter hut. Obtain meat and leather. Okay, we can grow food here. I feel like the farm is gonna be important, but let's let's get the let's get the cookhouse up. Or the hunter hut, I guess, is actually probably gonna be more vital. Uh, rotate you. You're gonna be like 
back door to the blacksmith. Do I have enough to get anything else? I saw something that looked like we could. No, they all turned red. We actually need more wood, too. Uh, speak with Hugo the worker and ask about the activity in your town. Where are you? Aren't you in the mine, though? You are just straight up broken right now. Hey, um, listen. I, I need to... Yeah. Quest. Been hearing noises north of town. Sounds like somebody... Go get stone. Sounds like someone is building something. Goodbye. Can you go get stone and stop being stuck in the ground, Hugo? You're like... Go chop trees. Stop trying to open the mine. The mine's already open. I think I think she's just straight up broken. I don't know what's happening there. It's <laughs> still early access and all that jazz. It's a thing. Uh, I guess I'm going to try to search north of town and find who is building something and why. But what if they don't want to share that information? Have I been attacking the tree thunk chunk the whole time? The hunter head is done. So now I can actually set somebody on that. I need more houses. That's like truly what I need is more houses. And in order to get more houses, I need more wood. Do we really only have one wood right now? No way. You don't need to talk to me. Just go do what you're doing. <laughs> Search north of town and discover what the deal is. I guess I can go do that. But I want to chop trees. I want to build a house to have more people. So now we can make foods and I need to have a cook. Oh, wait. No, I can't. That was the hunting hunt. I can tell people to go hunt, though. There's still something I need to do. <laughs> Alright, so what is somebody building up here and why? Probably building something that's nice and helpful, right? It's not going to be something that's bad. Is it going to be like our dwar dwarven brethren that are mad? Whoa. I don't think they're building something. It looks like they built something. There is straight up already a building there. Like, that's not in the beginnings of something. Is it going to be other people, though? Is it in another town? Because that would be kind of cool if there's towns we could trade with. That does not look like a happy town. What the heck? Me shady, not like other goblins. Just want to have shop. You need help? Need nine logs to make walls all done. Okay, so I just need to bring nine logs to you? I mean, don't I already have, like, maybe I don't have nine. That should be nine, though, right there. I have 21 logs, so I have more than you asked. Why didn't it pop up saying that I had them? Uh, give nine logs. Thank you. Only need six more logs. Okay. All I'm saying, man, is you better not you better not be a punk in the long run. Hooray, shop all done. Now you can buy stuff. Oh, you'll buy stuff from me? Okay, stop trying to headbutt the guy, man. Stop trying to headbutt the guy. Why do I keep pushing F? Push T. I want to see what I can sell. So I can sell these? You let me sell it? No, not that. You let me sell the simple axe. 30 gold. No, nope, I can't sell mushrooms to him. I sell copper ore? Nope. How about copper ingots? Nope. Alright, well, I'll take the 30 gold from that. That's fine. Okay, well, we got a goblin friend now. That has a shop over in the woods. What does he say? <laughs> shady shop. Okay. It's not shady at all. He seems like a good goblin. Is it just calling him shady because he is a goblin? Isn't that kind of like biased? Messed up. Can I grab this? Nope. I was invisible. What the heck is. I'm just gonna pretend like that tree's not floating. Speak with Hugo the worker and ask about her heirloom. But what if I don't want to? What if I don't want to know my townsfolk? I just want to stay inside. I just want to stay inside all the time, never go outside. So the fact that there really isn't a house for me to live in. I don't even have a house. All these houses that are in town are all the houses for people in the town. Hopefully we'll have enough stuff when I get back. I mean, I, how much stone are we sitting at? We got six. Oh, I only got nine wood left because I just gave all the wood to the dude. Say so this only gives you three total per tree, so there's that. Uh, that's less than ideal. Let's break you down. Come on. Fall down, tree. 
This is one of four? Okay, we're gonna have to do a whole bunch of stuff for her heirloom, it looks like. Just realize that. One of four missions. Talk to her, go find it, fight some people, do some things, make some people happy. Alright, chop down this tree. I wanna get the last of the wood here, and then I'm coming back to the town. I wanna build another house. Get two more people going. But like, the more people, the better, in a sense. At the same time, food wise, maybe not, but. We are maxed out on something. Oh, uh, can I can I look right here? Yeah, tools. We're maxed out on tools. Why are you just hanging out? I don't understand why you're just hanging out. Uh, all right. Well, you can do stuff there, but I'm not worried about that. I actually want to come back here. What does this place look like? I haven't been in the hunter's place. Speak with Hugo. Yeah, 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 yeah. Alright, let me quickly build another house. I should have enough. At least on me. Wooden house. I have to go... I do have... I have to actually go put all this stuff into the warehouse. Or otherwise, you can't build it. It makes sense, because I'm not physically building it. They are. Alright, then. Take all the wood. Take all the wood. There we go. Take all the stone I got. Take all the leather. Mushrooms mean nothing. Can't add any more copper. Speak with Hugo. Hugo. Are you still stuck in the mines? Hey, she's no longer, like, underground, at least. You know these things are already open. I don't know what you're doing. Uh, quest. Before she passed away, my mother gave me a ceremonial axe, and she was awarded with valor in battle. I'd like to display it in my house, and it was damaged when I traveled here. Okay. Craft a special handle at Ciri's shop, and use it to fix Hugo's axe. Series shop. What? Is that this dude? Okay, I guess so. Craft. Special hammer. Special handle. Because oh, I have to actually have it all on me. <laughs> I'm like, why can't I do this? I don't understand. Make all that up real quick. So I got those. I need to go get wood. And leather, which the leather I've been putting all in here. I'm not going to take the wood out of there. I feel like that's a waste. I'd actually prefer to just be like, boop. Can I slap another house down yet? Stone house. Wooden house. Uh, craft you up. I don't have enough gold. No! That sucks. I didn't even think about gold being a reason. The tree is not fully grown yet. Excuse me? I actually didn't know that was even a thing. He looks pretty tall to me. I guess it's not fully grown. All right, well, what about you? Is this enough? Yep, because you're about to fall. I always need more stone. Just give me everything that you can give me. Stop attacking the stone. Or the wood. I'll just take down this tree and one more tree, and I feel like we're probably good. I know I need to gather the wood. The tree's not fully grown yet. And you, you lie. That tree looks fully grown to me. <laughs> Alright. It's nice to know that the trees are going to grow back. I was wondering about that. Like, what happens when you chop all the trees down? Find the cave near town. What, what, what? What is this now? There's a cave near town? Is that not the... Is this different than the actual dungeon that I cleared earlier? I honestly don't know. I don't see a cave. So either it's pretty far off in the distance, or... Yeah, see, I already feel like we're not near town anymore. <laughs> yeah, I don't see anything at all. This is crazy. I want to know how big this map is. I honestly have no idea. Already there's been a bunch of things on this map that I wasn't expecting. Like that ruins area. I didn't expect to see a ruins area like that. Whoa. What is... This is not a cave? What is this? This is like a massive fortress. This does not seem good. And that looks scary. Like it's a bad place. You're telling me the cave's right here next to this massive fortress? Should I go in the fortress? I feel like I should. You didn't tell me to, but I feel like I should. 
Hello? Is there anybody home in this gigantic fortress? No? Alright then. Don't mind me running around your fortress. I'm just gonna roll out of here like nothing happened. Alright. <laughs> Look how this is the cave is like literally like right outside the massive fortress. Uh let's go inside the cave of emptiness. The cave of emptiness looks newly inhabited. The stench of evil permeates every crevice. Be wary. Okay. <laughs> Why do you refuse to use that scale? Bro! Use it! Boom! So yeah, I want to use that, but I don't want to get too close. There's just fire spouting up out of nowhere. Okay. That's a normal thing to see down here. Oh, it's copper down here. I was kind of surprised I actually didn't see any up there. Come on, buddy. I got something for you. It's a present. I'm going to just keep rolling because I don't want to get hit by that. Oh, I missed you. It would have been great with that special attack. Alright, metal. Metal. 11 copper ore. Alright, I'm down. You up here. This is the last room. It seems like three rooms seems to be the average, but nope, it looks like it keeps going. I can attack, apparently, in a straight line. Oh, didn't work like I'd hoped. Cave clear, but there's more stuff to get. Cave clearer achievement. Yeah, this is not clear. What you talk about? There's a whole other entrance right there. I mean, maybe it was clear of bad guys, but... I want to keep going further into the cave. I <laughs> gotta just forget about that person's axe. I'm just gonna continue on and just do my own thing. Anything good in here? Wait. Wait. That's how I. This is how I came in. Did I just really just completely turn myself around? Yeah, there was a place over here to the left. It's like no, 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 no. I know there was another way to go in here. Yeah. This is for another copper, but I'm totally okay with that. Imagine we're probably going to need this stuff for later on. Alright, I'm going to just push the escape and poof, we're outside in the cage. Outside of the cave, not inside a cage. I don't know why I said inside a cage. Obviously, poof, we're not inside a cage. That'd be a horrible way to leave. I mean, we are staying next to that big fort, though. I see that being a possibility. Alright, boom. So to make money at this shop, I'm going to end up having to, like, what, sell him... Sell him weapons and stuff, just craft things up and bring it over there and sell it. Because they could buy the axe. I mean, I think I have enough. I could make another copper axe, no problem. I could try to sell my copper axe and see how much it'll sell for. At the very least, not necessarily sell it to him right now, but... You. Talk to you, sell. It only sells for 40? No. No, it's not worth it. Can I chop down your trees? No? Okay. I mean, those seem too small to get a lot of wood out of anyways, but still. Okay, I gotta go make this lady's axe and then give it back to her, I assume. Hopefully she's not still sitting there trying to constantly open the mine, because that's unfortunate. That's one person that could be going to do something else. That's the way I look at it. You could be doing something else for me. I'm not paying these people to live here. No, no, no. They wanted to live above ground, too. I better not be paying these people. Speak with that another thing. About a recent illness. Now somebody's sick. No, 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 no. People aren't supposed to get sick. Alright, well. Just give me all the wood real quick. I'm gonna go put all this in there. and I feel like we should at least be able to build one or two houses. 17 wood. We have 40. We are maxed out on stone. Everybody's been going so ham on gathering stone. Maybe she's... Nope, she's still over there broken. That's good. That's always good. One person that doesn't do anything in town. <laughs> Alright. Oh, no, no, I needed that. I needed that, and I need wood. Alright. I didn't mean to take all of it, but okay, whatever. Uh, talk to you. Craft. The handle. I don't know why I keep putting it way down there. There we go. Special axe handle. Uh, clean Hugo's axe at the magic pool near the ruins. What? <laughs> what? Why would I do that? Seems, that seems, I mean, I guess whatever, man. 
Whatever, man. Seems weird, but I guess if you want me to, I'm fine with that. Uh, I do, however, for anything. Wooden house. It says a stone house, but I need stone mason. Two citizens in living greater comfort. Okay, wooden house. Just craft up another one of these. I uh, mean, I could start making room. Nah. Everybody's gonna be back to back. We got some ladies coming to the town. Uh, kind of loves doing manual labor of any kind. Is happier when the town is beautiful. Loves to cook and will often produce more meals. Enjoys studying magic, but hates doing manual labor. Honestly, you'll be my cook then. Uh, gets tired easily and sometimes takes a nap. Is less likely to catch an illness. I mean, I guess this. Likes doing manual labor. It's happier when the town's pretty. It's not pretty right now, so to that, but still. Alright. What is it? Metal workshop shop. Farm. Farm is the next thing I would ideally like to work on, which, I mean, now that I have the house going up, we got two more people. They can start farming stuff, resources, and everything. Oh, I did add it all back in there. So maybe I can just add some more there, but no. No, no. Uh, I'm gonna go over to this pool, I guess, and we're just gonna... How do I switch these? Press tab. Yeah, I'm gonna go over this magic pool and we're gonna finish out her thing. Speak with the dude about recent illness. I just, if I don't talk to him, maybe everything will be fine and nobody will be sick. That's kind of my goal here. The wooden house is completed. Yay! And we have two more people living in our town. This is for what? A grand total of six people? One person is broken, so we only got five useful people. But. <laughs> That's okay. It is what it is. As long as the other people do their jobs and gather lots of things. Oh, gee. Use the water in the magic pool. Bring Hugh's axe back to her. Okay, I'm bringing your axe back to you. Get out of the mine entrance and get to work, lady. Siri had a good day. Okay. Good for you? Why? That's new. I haven't had anybody say that they had a good day. I don't, I don't know what that means, like, what what happened that's different. I didn't realize how hurt I was. <laughs> I looked at my health and I'm like, ooh, where's my health bar at? It's non-existent. All right, let's go to the stamina. I not go to the stamina, go back to Hugo. My stamina is, like, really low. Hugo, can you please get out of the mine? I was going to try to attack you out, but it didn't work. Uh, Quest. Thank you so much for fixing my mother's axe. I know she'd be grateful for what you did, too. Go get stone. Goodbye. Oh, my God. <laughs> nope, she's forever opening that. All right, well, I think I am going to leave this here for now. I enjoy this game. This game's fun. I, I look like it'd be entertaining with the little building aspects. Yeah, see, we'll have a little road in no time. Except for this gap right here. Oh, no. Oh, no. But, yeah, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Let me know if you guys want to see more of this. Uh, I will do at least one or two like usual, and if you guys enjoy it, I'll continue on, but bye-bye for now.